My plush campaign on Onash.com has now been extended to June and is currently limited to 100 plushies. So if you'd like to support the channel and you need more time to get the plush, well, now you got more time. So yeah, it's on Onash.com. Link in the description if you'd like to buy it. And like I said, it really helps support the channel. It'd be really appreciated. Uh, thank you. enough. I feel like I'm floating. Are we in like some kind of space dimension? I don't know. Uh, guys, I think we might be falling. Oh, I believe we are. Huh. I mean, that makes sense. The odds that we would land on solid ground 100% of the time is pretty low, all things considered. I think I lost one of my nine lives. <sighs> Where are we? We look to be in some kind of jungle. Oh, let's get the hell out of here. Uh, guys? Where's the watch? Huh? The watch? It shouldn't be around you. Oh, there's no watch there. Ah, where's the watch? God, oh God, it's over here. Um, maybe, maybe it fell in the bush. Come on, come on, it's gotta be around here. It's a watch, it's not a needle. And this isn't a haystack, it's a bush, so it should be easier retroactively, right? Come on, I can't have landed that far. Uh, you know, uh, I saw it on you when we, we, you know, we teleported in here. Who knows when it fell off his body? Uh, perhaps it bounced around somewhere. Oh God, am I kidding? This jungle is so dense, it could be anywhere. <sighs> There's no way we're stranded here. There's no way. Uh, guys? What is it, Candy? What is it? I think I may have found our watch. Ooh, shiny. Lots of hieroglyphs, too. Oh, thank God, ma'am. Thank you for finding our watch. Can we no, it's mine! Finders, keepers, losers, weepers. Ma'am, you don't understand. We, we really, really need that watch. You are the losers, and you are weeping. Weeping, weeping, I tell you! She do that! Do that, Chica! Don't worry, guys. I got this. There's a vine right there. Hurry! Oh, God. Ah. <laughs> Thanks, Springtrap. I'm soaked now. Hey, man. I don't want to get wet. Look at me. I'm already filthy. <laughs> <laughs> So cold. Ah, great. How could she swing between vines? It's freaking crazy. Oh, let's already write our wills. We're gonna have to live in this jungle for the rest of our days and become savages. I did not just get soaked in this river for us to give up. There's gotta be another way across. Even then, we don't even know where she went even if we managed to get across. If only there's some kind of landmark or something that... Hey, what's that over there? It looks like some kind of rock structure. Maybe that's where she's going. Her home, maybe? I mean, it's worth a shot. Heck, maybe some people there know where she is. All right, uh, let's go over there. <clears throat> I feel like I've been bit by over a hundred mosquitoes at this point. Guys, look! Whoa. Ancient city. Well, I mean, technically speaking, ancient is a relative term. Uh, this is actually a modern day city, just with the preconceived notion of what we believe an ancient city to look like. We are in the modern day. This is just what their technology looks like in the modern day. Are you done? I'm sorry. <sighs> Pop goes, you look cute with a monocle. Oh, um, thank you? Let's just get in here and see if anyone knows where that lady is. <clears throat> Watch your step. This bridge is rickety. Who stands foot in our home? Uh, we're peaceful. We're just passing through. Yeah, we're not trying to cause trouble, man. We're trying to look for something we lost. We're just hoping someone around here could help. What about you, pal? Uh, me? Uh, same mission as these guys. Why? I'm watching you. Wait, what? what? I'm just saying, man. 
The British didn't do the nicest things to these kinds of places. How do we even know they've gone through the same conflicts? Mm. Well, you seem free to pass through. Don't stir up trouble, or we'll toss you in the river, and the piranhas will munch you. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Well, that was weird. All right, let's ask around. Excuse us. Hmm. Those guys are odd to me. <sighs> I haven't seen some of these faces in a while. You seem to know a lot of people that, you know, reside in multiple dimensions. What can I say? I'm social. What's this place? Ah, hello, you three. Welcome to the infirmary. Yes, we make people feel better. Much better than they felt before. Uh, hey, uh, listen, fellas. Uh, you guys see anybody that came through here, uh, you know, a yellow chicken with a watch? I do not appear to have a watch. No, 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 you're orange. Uh, yellow is a different color. Mm. Don't believe so. Any other notable characteristics? Uh, well, it looked like she had some kind of thing growing out of her head. Hmm. Perhaps maybe they have been through to our infirmary. Yes, our infirmary make people feel- Yes, our infirmary make people feel better. Yeah, 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 I get it. Uh, alright. We can take a look around. Yeah, probably wouldn't hurt. <clears throat> Am I going to die, brother? Perhaps, but there is off chance that you survive. You know, they say one in 200,000 people that suffer this injury survive. I don't like those odds. Excuse me, fellas. <laughs> oh, hello there, visitors. Uh, this is my brother. He has no legs. I can see that. Hey, you kind of remind me of the guy in the bed next to us. Huh? Huh? <coughs> hey. Look at you, handsome devil. <laughs> Shucks. Um, what happened to you? Uh, smallpox. Some conquistadors came through and gave it to me. Jeez. <coughs> oh, Man, I really hope they have modern medicine. I feel bad. What's a medicine? Oh. Uh, anyways, to the point. Have any of you three seen a yellow chicken run through with a watch? We're kind of looking for her. Uh-uh. Mm -mm. It's just been us three all day. <sighs> Great. <coughs> hey, if either of you three are looking for anybody... <coughs> Perhaps you should talk to the Emperor! The Emperor? Ah, he makes good point. The Emperor knows all. The Emperor probably help you be able to find her. <laughs> well, uh, thanks. Yeah, uh, one more question. Where is this Emperor? Top of the temple. <laughs> Where he always is. Oh, uh, thank you. Hope you feel well soon. <sighs> He's probably not going to. <clears throat> thanks. Good luck on finding your chicken or something. <laughs> Whoa. That's a huge temple. Uh, hey, how do we get up to the top to see the king? You have to climb it. Oh. Wait, what? We have to climb it? What about the inside? Is there not, like, stairs or something? No. No one goes inside the temple. They say it has an ancient curse inside it. However, the curse protects these lands. No one stepped in or out. <sighs> All right. Let's find the start of the stairs. <laughs> Stairs. <laughs> hey, uh, what are you guys doing? Eh, what's it look like? We are artists! Yes, we are artists! We make art! Is that supposed to be us? Yes! Sometimes we like to write down agenda of all day. And all time. You three are the first new people we've seen in months. We figured we'd write you down some for the occasion. Aw, oh, shucks, I'm flattered. So, all these other events, uh, there's stuff that's actually happened? Yeah, over the last few weeks. Funny thing, we've had someone go into temple that hasn't happened in a long time. It was a new, another new person. Huh. 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 Hey, uh, what did this person look like? Oh, huh, hard to describe. Uh, monkey! Yes, they were monkey. Monkey. Brown fur. And tan inner fur. Yes, both those things are true. And wear strange green clothing. Yes, it was like two green legs. One green body and two green stick things that went over their arm shoulders. Uh, what did they say their name was? Uh, checkers? Something along those lines? Candy. 
I fear that maybe Chester went to the temple. Wait, like, the Chester you told me about? Yeah. He's here. I think so. And went inside the ancient cursed temple. Mm-hmm. <sighs> Let's get the hell up to the top so we can ask the king how to save him. Out of our way, fellas. Thanks for the tip. <sighs> Hold on, Chester. Um, we're coming, buddy. <sighs> We made it. It was daylight to spit. It's night! Okay, let's not dwell on the details. I think I'm gonna throw up. Hold it together, we're literally about to meet royalty. Ugh. Emperor! We come requesting help! Um, um, more. Huh? Of course the Emperor is a cupcake. Oh, hello there. I see you come seeking wisdom of the Emperor? Yes. Your Majesty. What are you doing? Bowing. Oh, uh, please, uh, we don't do that here. Oh, uh, so, uh, what are you three in need of the king? Are you two the only two people up here? Uh, yeah, as far as the looks of it. Just me and my lady. Do the two of you live up here? Oh no, I live in a small house down the river. Wait, you don't live here? Do you climb this temple every day? Uh, yeah, I've got some rather well-defined calf muscles because of it. Huh, anyways, what are the three of you come seeing from the Emperor? Uh, right, Mr. Emperor, sir. Listen, we got a couple problems. First of all, there's this yellow chicken that came through and stole our watch. We were hoping maybe you've seen her around. <laughs> seen her around. <laughs> Boy, I ain't left this temple since I was 13. 13? How old are you now? 34, I think. Oh my god. Okay, well that's of no help. Come on, don't tell me you what climbed up this whole temple just asking me that. That was the initial plan, but listen, one of our friends apparently walked into the temple. Ah! <laughs> yeah, they're dead. <sighs> My candy! <laughs> He'll be okay, right? <sighs> I'll go get him. Wait, Pop goes, you sure? It's fine. I'll go get him. All right, we're losing focus. Listen, our friend got trapped in the temple. You're sure he's dead? You sure there's nothing we can do? Boy, that temple's been cursed forever. My father's never been in there. His father's never been in there. Bounce back another 12, 13 generations. I don't think any of their fathers have been in there. Nobody that ever goes in that temple makes it out alive. You know, and plus I missed something in the last 21 years, but I'm pretty dang sure that track record's still set. Ugh, so you're saying he's dead? Like, for good dead? I mean, it's possible he's alive. However, there's no real way of proving it unless you went in too. That's what we're gonna have to do. Well, dang, you sure? It's a life or death mission in there. Uh, trust me, I've been through worse. Well, it was a pleasure with speaking with the two of you, your majesty. Uh, I gotta go find my friends. Oh, and, and you too, ma'am. Shucks, I don't really know if I'm old enough to be called ma'am yet. How old are you? Mm, 12, maybe 13. Uh! That was tonal whiplash for the era we're currently in. Huh? What's that guy talking about? Oh, sick freaking creep. Uh. Uh. Oh my man. Uh. 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 Candy! Candy! Are you okay? Uh. I think I broke like 80 bones. Oh, come on. You gotta be alright, man. We have more important things to worry about. Oh, Chester! Oh, God, Chester! Oh, no, poor Chester! Poor sweet innocent Chester! He was so young! Guys! Ugh. I spoke to the Emperor. Oh, really? What'd you learn? First of all, he's a freaking creep. He's 34 dating a 12-year-old. Ew! Yeah, I know. Second of all, he said that technically it's never been proven that anyone's died in this temple. That's, you know, no one's ever went out. So the only way for us to really know if Chester's dead is if we go in. <sighs> of course it is. It's never easy with these things, is it? <sighs> and not even to mention the fact that we still have no idea where our watch is. All right, gang. Let's go into this temple. 
as soon as we find the entrance. Maybe it's on the other side? Yeah, yeah, we should probably go look. <sighs> Musty in here. Well, presuming what, you know, the Emperor said, people don't come in here super often. It's not like he's got maids coming in here dusting the place. Surprised this place isn't riddled with booby traps. Me too. Maybe the ancients feared they would set them off. Knowing how I am, I probably would be too. No sign of Chester yet. Yeah, I'm starting to get worried. Look, we'll find him. We always do. What if we don't this time? What if Chester's a lost cause? What if he's our first casualty of this whole thing? Don't say that. Besides, we don't even have any evidence he's dead. You know, that should make me feel better, but I feel like that makes it worse. <sighs> mm. This place does give me the creeps, though. Like, something died in here a while ago. Didn't he literally say people die in here all the time? Every time they come in here, someone's dead. You're not helping! Come on, Pop goes lighten up. Hasn't even been anything dangerous that showed up yet. Oh! What the? Is that a gold statue? Of a monkey? Jester? Oof! Ow, Candy! Uh, sorry, I was just hoping he was here. Well, no, it just seems to be this monkey statue. Kinda coincidental that it's a monkey statue, though. What's that huge lump of gold behind it? Hmm. Huh. I don't know. It is a strangely shaped lump of gold, though. I don't know, guys. I feel like we searched this whole thing and he's just not here. It's gotta be somewhere, right? I don't know. Maybe if we move the gold statue, it'll open a secret entrance or something? Yeah, you're right. Maybe there's a hole behind it. I don't think it's happening. Yeah, that thing's got to weigh a ton. I don't even know if the three of us can move it. Chester Pal, we're gonna get you out of there! <sighs> Did you all hear that? Hey, what? It sounded like a snake. There's probably at least one or two snakes lying around here. I mean, yeah, but it echoed more than I thought it would. Spring Child, this whole place is filled with echoes. Just like, listen to this. Hello! See? Stop being so worryful. Like you said, this place creeps me out, but you're right. Knowing that there's pretty much nothing that's come to harm our way so far, it leaves me confident. I appreciate you're starting to gain confidence, Pop Goes, but I think I'm starting to lose it. The amount of nothing here is giving me some kind of unease. <sighs> I'm sure it's nothing, man. I'm sure it's nothing. Well, well, well. What do we have here? <gasps> of course it's another me. I can't go one dimension without finding an evil version of me. Hey, we went a few without finding evil versions of you, though. You never find a good version of me, either. That one purple guy didn't seem so bad that we found earlier. Okay, yeah, but he's probably gonna die! Well, well, well. It seems you three have stumbled into my temple. <laughs> Unfortunate. Not far after the last guy. This guy. You mean Chester? You mean the monkey? Yes, the monkey! Where's he at? <laughs> Where is he? You were standing right next to him just a moment ago. What are you talking about? No. No! Chester! You! Lump of gold? That's Chester? What happened to him? You change him back right now! <laughs> I couldn't even if I wanted to, boy. I was gonna go through with my usual. However, your little friend got a little too handsy with the artifacts. He lifted it right up. Why? Welcome to my temple. <laughs> You're probably wondering who I am. Move it, Dumbo! Oh! Ah. Shiny object! Shiny object! <laughs> and there he lay still. He's lucky. He didn't have to suffer fate at my hands. Only his own. It's admirable. Moronic, but admirable. So you're saying Chester's stuck like that forever? 
Unfortunately, that appears to be the case. I'm sorry, Candy. I'm sorry for dragging you guys in here. It's not your fault, Candy. He's a part of your family. He deserved to be saved, too. Oh, enough with the misery. You're dimming the mood. Hey, can it, will ya? We're grieving over here. Grief? <laughs> Feeling grief. At a moment like this, when all you should feel is fear. No! Oh, 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 my nose. You all will make fine sacrifices to cancel Kawazo. <laughs> Immortality doesn't come without a price. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I'm okay. It's funny. Normally I find curious loners in here. Or the odd couple looking for adventure. Never a trio, especially on a rescue mission. Let's see how many centuries you add to my lifespan. I'm hungry after missing out on the monkey. Is all you do talk? I like it better when they shut up! Perhaps I underestimated you three. You're capable. Filled with energy. Mm -hmm. All the more for me to take from you. Whoa! Perhaps there's some needed assistance. I don't get to bring her out often. This will be nice. Wake up, serpent! I have something for you to play with! Did he say serpent? Dance, monkeys, dance! My own weapon against me. There's more where that came from, pal. Shameful. Does it look like I give a shit? I sacrifice you to my great Quetzalcoatl. Why? Because I know a thing or two about those. They usually don't go too well. Well, they've went perfectly fine for me for centuries. What's the Aztec god of death's name again? Muklantakutli. Don't you dare speak that name in the temple of Quetzalcoatl. What, are you scared of it? What are you pulling? <laughs> hey, I'm over here, pal. <laughs> Woo! How to tame a serpent! Woo! <laughs> uh, uh, looks like this is my stop! Huh? Now, Bob goes! Huh? You know how to tie a knot? Uh, I think so. Well, get ready! Have the tail! <laughs> we make a pretty good team, man. Thanks for the save. Hey, thanks for the assist. Guys, I appreciate the bromance, but a little bit of help would be nice. No! No! Oh, me, you weasel! How do you know that hold? Mux Lantakuli could not have taught you that! Impossible! Yeah, you're right. I studied the dark arts. I figured it out. <gasps> no! I call upon the great Mukhtlan Takudli. Take the life back this man had stolen from others. Pay tenfold the abuse of the great Quetzalcoatl. No! Rise! <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
dead person guts off of me. That may have been the most horrifying thing I've ever seen in my entire life. I don't think I'm going to be able to sleep tonight. Ah, trust me, bud. Whenever you're as advanced as I am in the dark arts, you learn a thing or two. <sighs> okay, you restored balance in that thing. Hopefully. That's definitely not going to bring back all the dead people, but, you know. <sighs> it's a shame about poor Chester. Well, he held a curse on this temple, so... Quetzalcoatl is setting things back the way they should be. Ooh. Ooh, shiny object! No, 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 you do not want that. You do not want that. You do not want to know what happens if you touch that. Oh, come on, but it's so shiny, man. Who are you? Uh, I'm one of your friend's friends. And you're British. That's normal. Not where I'm from. <laughs> uh, then we win. <gasps> Chester! Oh, buddy, I thought I lost you. <laughs> okay, buddy, chill out on the monkey and around. Every bone in my body hurts. This is not good. Oh, oh sorry, sorry. <laughs> oh, man, it's been forever since I've seen you. It's weird. One day there was a weird flash of light, and then I woke up in this strange place, and there was a jungle. It was really weird people. They told me to not go into the temple, but I was like, oh, this temple looks really cool. So I walked into the temple, and then I found this thing, and then I was like, oh, this looks really cool. But then there was this big... Weird blue rabbit guy. Kind of looks like that guy, but not quite. Also, kind of looks like that guy, but that guy's dead. Anyway, so I knocked him out of the way because I saw a shiny object like that one. I touched it, and then everything went all dark. And then I woke up, and then I found this guy. And then this guy told me not to touch that. So I'm taking his advice. <sighs> it's good to have you back, bud. You too! I know we're trying to kill us and all, but I kind of feel bad for the serpent. Well, now with no master to serve, it should be harmless. There you go, buddy. like a puppy. Okay, run along now. <sighs> All's well that ends well. So, you know how I ended up here? I mean, you guys had to get here somehow. Uh, I mean... Oh, well, you see, we actually traveled through a few dimensions to find you. Wait, Pop Ghost. We use this watch with Remnant, but we don't have any more, but, you know, we're going to find it again. And, you know, we've been trying to find all you guys, because you've been spread across the multiverse. We already found Blank and the Penguin. And, you know, you can go back and see them. <gasps> the multiverse? Like, think of all those books and movies that I've seen? Oh, that's really real. I can't believe that's really real. That's me all about it, all the different things you've seen. The smart guy, you're like Doctor Who. You know Doctor Who? I know Doctor Who. He's like British, he's a scientist, the funny-looking screwdriver thing, and a phone box. Do you have a phone box? No, we have a watch. Be prepared to have a chatterbox on your hands for the next couple minutes. <laughs> Where to begin a watch? Wow, this watch, who made the watch? Uh, a guy named Scott Cawthon. Ooh, Scott Cawthon, that's a really normal name, but not really normal name at the same time, I don't really know. I knew a guy named Scott once, he worked at a supermarket. You know the supermarket that I buy bananas from candy? Yeah, that supermarket. He only usually comes in on Mondays and Thursdays, but sometimes Saturday, depending on if he covers his friend's shift. <sighs> hey, you all right, man? Oh, it's, it's nothing. Okay, clearly something's bothering you. What's up? You know, it's just, with every me we've encountered, right? So far, the track record's either they're completely evil and terrible people, or they're gonna die, probably. I mean, sure, but not like we've encountered that many yous. What's to worry about? Always gonna be a couple bad eggs in a, in a basket. You know, if there's more me and more pop goes, I'm sure there's a couple of us that are pretty rotten. That's the thing, though. I've been told my entire life that I'm destined to be evil. Something that only harbors chaos and bad things on people, you know? I just... I'm starting to wonder if they're right. Springtrap, come on. You think either me or Pop Girls could have made it this far without you? I'm not gonna act like we were totally useless. I'm sure even you can admit we saved a keys to a couple times. Shoot, you just did a couple minutes ago. But neither of us would have gotten nearly this far without you. Shoot, your knowledge of the dark arts, remnant, the multiverse? Our family going missing was completely unrelated to you, yet you still bothered helping us. Once you figure that watch out, you could have kicked me to the curb. Said, screw you, you know, just decided to go home. But you didn't. You stuck with us. You felt like you owed it to us. Now, would somebody evil do something like that? Probably not. See? You're just a good one in a basket of bad eggs. Listen to him, man. 
You're our number one, our numero uno. I never trade you for nothing. Ain't that right, Pop Goes? Yeah, Springtrap told me his name's Kane or so. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, whatever you said. Who oh, Kane? Like Candy Cane? If he knew what I was talking about, he'd agree with me. Thanks, Candy. Now, come on, let's get out of here. It's dark. Oh, right. Uh, come on, guys. And then there's this guy named Emil Mako, which I think has something to do with your guys. <laughs> finally, some sunlight. Ugh. Yeah, finally. Happy you managed to make it out alive, Chester. Ah, thank you guys for saving me. When are we gonna get to go home? That's the problem, Chester. We lost the watch. Oh, can we at least get a good nap in before we go looking for it? I'm beat. So, how much do you think it's worth? Huh? I'll give you 15 rocks for it. 15 rocks? Come on, it's at least worth 25. Highest though goes 20. 23, 22. Fine. Shiny object! Wait, 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 just a wait! Huh? Shiny <laughs> 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 object! Oh, hey! Is this a watch you guys were looking for? Yeah. Thanks for, thanks for getting it back, Chester. No problemo! Uh, when do we get to go home? I miss Blank and Penguin, and Cindy, and all those guys. Oh, Cindy. Yeah, we haven't quite found her yet. Eh, don't say it like that, Candy, we will. I don't know. Alright, what are we waiting for? Alright, let's go. I need a nap after this. Assistance from the infirmary?